An interstellar comet, 3I Atlas, just hit the solar system, and one wild plan says NASA's Juno could chase it down. Is a Jupiter slingshot and a last burst of fuel enough to pull this off? First, the facts. 3I Atlas was found July 1, 2025 by Atlas. Hubble saw a dusty coma. It skims the sun October 30, then passes near Jupiter March 2026. Can Juno meet it there in time? The proposal, fire Juno's engines September 9, 2025, dive deeper at Jupiter, then use an Oberth maneuver. With 2.7 kilometers per second of Delta V, its path could cross 3I around March 14 through 16. What's the catch? Here's the catch. Juno's old, low on fuel, and its engine has history. A big burn risks the mission and IO science, and nothing's approved. This is only a study. What's the payoff? A flyby would be historic. First close look at an interstellar comet. Juno's IR UV microwave particles, magnetometer, and camera could sample ices, dust, fields, and plasma. Even without Juno, others may watch. Juice and Psyche pass within 0.3.4 AUs. Mars orbiters might catch it near October, but a near pass beats telescopes. What makes timing so brutal? Speed, 3i Atlas screams at 61 kilometers per second and won't linger. Post-discovery Earth launches need impossible Delta V, so Jupiter's gravity assist is the only shot. Is NASA likely to say yes? Bottom line, if approved and the burn works, Juno could skim 3i's path in March 2026, our best shot to sample chemistry from another star. If not, this visitor vanishes into deep space.